So if you watch a lot of documentaries in newsreels, I mean newsreels, of World War II, you'll get the impression that Hitler was always observing a goose-stepping parade all over Europe. And the truth of the matter is, it's propaganda and fake footage. Now, I happen to notice something. I just froze this film <clears throat> in this particular spot to start it. But if you will notice, they're even giving you clues here. The hand itself is darkened. This one. It looks a little bit like a monster. <laughs> and this one's light. So little clues like that. But we'll watch it in normal speed, then I'll stop it and try to get to something and show you a few things. Okay, now in order to make this kind of real easy for the film producers, they may have maybe a hundred men or whatever and just film one section then you just keep repeating it over and over again, the same thing that you film. So it looks like there's an infinite number of soldiers goose-stepping. There he is, Walt Disney himself. Now, one individual pointed out that the world was programmed to pay attention to a brush mustache like this through the actor Charlie Chaplin. So anybody that wears a mustache like that, pay attention. That's what Charlie Chaplin did, whether that actor knew it or not, and they borrowed it to put it under Hitler. So immediately everybody's eye would be glued on the man with a little brush mustache like that. You know, this is where I want you to see how close the Fuhrer is to the parade, but yet it's distorted, all right? And if my memory serves me correctly, You'll see a little letter E that will appear right here on his shoulder blade. That stands for editing. So I'm going to put it in real slow-mo motion and see if we can capture it. Okay, going backwards. There it was. Did you see it? It's right here. Right here.
Okay, I'm trying to show it to you. But anyhow, Walt Disney is in a studio. There's a big movie screen in front of him. And they're trying to splice it together in such a way to make you think that he's at these goose-stepping parades. You can see how close the images are to his body. And they show his back, not his face. They showed his face, you might realize something. But it's distorted. <laughs> So you just take the same trucks and keep uh, splicing it in so it looks like there's an infinite supply of trucks. Now once again you can see how distorted this is with the image of Hitler observing a parade. It makes more sense what I'm telling you that he's in a studio, Walt Disney Studio, and there's a big film screen in front of him of a bunch of German soldiers goose-stepping. France was waiting. Okay. Well, anyhow, I thought I'd fool around a little bit with that. This concludes the video. Thank you for watching.